Congratulations on your new BradyJet Industrial Inkjet printer. Let's help you get it set up and ready to print. After you take the printer out of the box and out of the bag, it's important to note what came in the box with the printer and how you will be able to utilize these different components to set up your system. Once you have your printer placed safely on a flat surface, the first thing you should do is load your four individual ink cartridges into their designated slots. For more information on loading ink cartridges, check out this video. Next, take the power cord and plug one end into the printer and the opposite into a power outlet. Then, take the CD you received in the box and insert it into the disk drive of your computer. The CD will prompt you with the proper steps to load the printer driver and the Brady Jet status monitor onto your computer. You'll be instructed to plug the printer into your computer via a USB cord. And at this time, you can also turn your printer on using the switch in the back. Please note that if you do not have a disk drive on your computer, you can download all of this from BradyID.com. From here, you will be prompted to align the print head. This is where you have to be a little patient. It's important to give the printer time to process what steps you've done, so wait around 10 to 15 seconds after each step before moving on to the next. As you can see by the prompts on the screen, the first three steps on initial setup will not be relevant to you as there won't be any tape installed, so bypass those until you reach the first relevant prompt. During the alignment process, you will need to adjust the media guides to insert the alignment paper that was provided in the box with the new printer. This alignment paper is provided just for this process, and it's very important that you use it. You will feed the alignment paper through the rollers and close the cover. The printer should automatically feed the paper and begin printing. If this happens, then you know that you've loaded it correctly. If the printer does not start printing on the alignment paper within a minute or so, just try it again. Once the alignment has completed, you will need to remove the paper from the mouth of the printer, and from there, you will be able to install your first roll of media. Check out this video for more details on how to load your label material. If you happen to run into any issues with the first print, such as the print not aligning on the label, or the cutter cutting into the label, please see our additional videos for further instructions.